Hi Mike's carburetor injector parts here. I'm going to show you how to rebuild it in one of the injectors. This one happens to be for a BMW, but the rebuilding process will be uh, similar for just about anything you do. So, uh, first thing we're going to do is we're going to take off the O-rings and we're going to keep them in order because uh, they could be the same, they could be a little bit offset. So, uh, uh, going this way you might take a picture okay so this is the way it's going to go on now this happens to have the same o-ring on both ends so it's not a problem okay one other thing we need to do is remove the uh, filter there's a micro filter in here and we got this handy dandy little tool as our T840 is our part number for it and we just uh, take this in here and screw it in like a so and pull it out just like that okay okay so then we take this and uh, we put in our ultrasonic cleaner that's the best way to do it uh, you can try there's di different uh, methods of doing it yourself but the most the best way is through our uh, ultrasonic cleaner and tester uh, we uh, like say we clean it and then we check it for uh, balance make sure all the Injectors are uh, spraying the same. You check it for ohms and uh, the spray pattern. Very important. So if you get one injector that's just not quite spraying uh, like the rest of them, you're going to have a miss at idle especially. Okay, so uh, we're going to put it back together and uh, do it just the opposite way. Uh, I'd put a, put a dab of oil on here on each show ring. Not much, just a little bit to help you put it on. Like I saw, I'm going to borrow one of these because I only I lost one of the new ones. Uh, there, so there you go. The O-rings are back on. Now we're going to put the uh, filter back in and we use the other end of our T840 tool and screw that on a little bit like that set it on and uh, put it in there and then you just take it and put some pressure on it until it's in there flush just like a soap okay i tap it on my vise a little bit just to make sure all right it's not going anywhere so there you got it it's rebuilt you put it back in this is all you need uh, to put it together okay so that's how you rebuild a fuel injector. So I appreciate you watching. And you can get parts at uh, mikescarb.com, M-I-K-E-S-C-A-R-B.com. Thanks again.